Well, the benchmarks closed in the red and uh, a bit of a surprise because we started off very, very well. Midway through the day, we were very close to life highs or we did clock life highs on the Nifty and the bank Nifty. But we've closed around a quarter of a percent, around a fifth of a percent lower on the Nifty 50. And the Nifty bank closing largely flat. No complaints there. In fact, they've, uh, Nifty bank has closed around the 49,400 mark. Uh, you know, that's, that's probably something one can live with because we were down almost uh, a third of a percent on the Nifty Bank. The Nifty mid-cap, though, a quarter of a percent higher. Uh, so, uh, positive there. In fact, it clocked its life high today as well, but the Nifty small cap absolutely flat. That was the texture of the market. Let's pull up the advanced decline. And uh, that's where you'll see the start of trade, very positive. We tapered through the day and we've closed at the end with the declines, in favor of the declines, in fact. 1100 declines to 856 advances. That was how the market closed. Let's quickly pull up the heat map, see some names and see where the market headed. Uh, auto stocks were in focus. Nifty Auto, in fact, uh, was a top sectoral gainer in trade today. 4.75% higher on m and That's where that one has closed. Uh, look at the likes of a Hero, a Bajaj, all of which uh, were in the green and well in the green. 1.5% plus higher on all of those. Uh, some of the financials also uh, took some of, uh, 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 did some of the lifting. 2% on Sriram Finance. Uh, you also had an HDFC Life up 1.6%. Some of the smaller banks, something like an Indusind, was up uh, around 1.5 odd percent. Uh, you also had an SBI Life up around 4 fifths of a percent. The losers, IT was uh, the top sectoral uh, uh, drag, in fact, in terms of uh, where uh, Tech Mahindra is at. We also had something uh, like a Tata Steel, but some of the pharma stocks, which were uh, drags in trade today as well. Let's pull up the sectoral uh, uh, heat map uh, to try and gauge where we were. Look at the Nifty Auto, top sectoral gainer. Realty also up 1.5 odd percent. But the Lagards, IT, 1.1 percent lower. The top sectoral loser, Media and Metal 2, 1 percent plus lower uh, on both of those. Pharma was the other key drag. Uh, flat on the FMCG, so no complaints there. Let's pull up the BSE 500. Largely, uh, earnings being the real uh, push here. Look at PFC, look at REC. REC disclosed numbers, by the way. 10% up on that stock. 4,000 crore is where the profit after tax came in at versus the 3,000 crore number same time last year. So very strong set. But outside of that, Gillette also has done fairly well, 7.5% higher. On the losers, Birla Soft, Indian Oil, uh, Motilal Oswal seeing a bit of a cool off, but Spark and Eureka Forbes, the top losers on the BSE 500. Uh, that's all uh, for this Tuesday afternoon.